The objective of the Cretaceous Sea exhibit is basically to introduce our current students, both geology students and biology students, and I'm discovering as we're setting it up a variety of other students who find it rather intriguing, to instill into them the size, the magnitude, what these beasts look like that wandered in this inland sea 90 million years or so ago. During the Cretaceous period, there was a large, what we call an inland sea. It basically was a seaway, marine waters that extended from the Gulf of Mexico and continued up through and it came in contact and connected with the Arctic Ocean. And in this into western interior sea, it occupied most of eastern Alberta, western Saskatchewan, and going down through the prairie states as well. It was a relatively shallow water sea and was basically inhabited by a number of very large and very intriguing organisms. The large elasmosaurus that we see upstairs in the second level is found fairly abundantly uh, in the Fort McMurray area by Suncor. These are all marine reptiles, so they can be mounted or suspended in the ceiling relatively easily, out of the way of traffic and so on, and still be quite visible and quite uh, interesting to take a look at. The major supporter, in fact, the sponsor of this particular exhibit is Apega. Uh, they have been very supportive of the geology program here at Mount, Mount Royal University and this is simply a continuation of their, their generosity uh, to help fund uh, this. It's a fairly expensive project to put on to only they've, they've contributed a significant amount of money. As we look around here, uh, you'll see a lot of people all doing various things. Uh, physical resource people in the signage, simply getting things helped uh, put up, painting, you name it, drywalling, they are just, and with tremendous enthusiasm, they really enjoy doing something which is relatively novel and quite different from what they would normally do in a fairly mundane task. So lots of people on staff, I can't thank the uh, support staff, so on, enough for all their help in getting this thing together. The attempt was try to get as many representatives of the reptilian group as we possibly could. We have all of the marine ones that are available. The only poor animal that's missing are the dinosaurs. These are not dinosaurs. They are marine reptiles, but they are not dinosaurs. So the dinosaur is the missing link that we are, have yet to uh, acquire. But we have plans. <laughs>